Jared Poland, Frono's Photo. Dot com here with a 30 for 30 Lightroom quick tip video brought to you by the fine people over at Adobe. If you want to follow along, you can go to fronosphoto.com slash LR3030. You can download a free trial of Lightroom so that you can play along with all of the videos that we're making. And let's get into it. Here's a quick tip for cleaning up your workspace. Now Lightroom is great because they give you so many different options and buttons to click. But that also means that there's a ton of stuff interfering with your workspace that you may not want. So Adam, how can we clean this up? Well, it's very easy. Uh, most of these things you can clean up by just right clicking very near that area. So for example, when I'm using uh, Lightroom, I don't want the map module. I don't want the book module. I don't know if I want slideshow, print, or web. I'm predominantly in library and develop. So if I just right click up here, I can uncheck all of the ones that I don't want, just simply like this. And you can see they disappear and that actually helps to clean up my workspace. And not only does it clean it up, it's just sometimes you accidentally hit the wrong ones if you're not using quick keys. And I'm like, I don't want to go into that module. So what if you want to get them back? Very easily, you just right click in the same region and you hit show all and they're all right back there for you. All right, let's get into the, uh, the develop module on the right hand side and see what options we have. Okay, so when you have all of these different adjustment windows over here, or adjustment panes, sometimes it's a lot to scroll through all of them. Well, especially if you're on a, a laptop versus being on a larger screen. Exactly. 27 inch iMac, yes, you're going to see all of those modules. On your laptop, not so much. So what you can do is you right click right at the top here. You can eliminate certain ones. So let's say you don't do a lot of split toning. You just get that one out of the way. Now let's say you just want to go into solo mode where you're only going to be in the one that you're actually working in. It will collapse the other ones so that it keeps your workspace nice and tidy. Right, and you're not actually getting rid of anything. It's there, you can just turn it back on. It's all pretty simple stuff. It's a lot of right clicking and just reading and you could always turn stuff off and then turn it all back on. It's a pretty simple quick tip and if you wanna follow more Quick tips and the 30 for 30, the Lightroom edition. Go to fronosphoto.com slash LR3030. You could also download a free trial of Adobe Lightroom so that you can follow along and play with all of the things that we're doing right here in these quick tip videos. But that is where we're going to leave it. Jared Poland, fronosphoto.com. See ya.